Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another Summer Enrichment Activity Day. Today, we're going to be doing a game of parachute partner toss and ring toss. What you're going to need first off is two bags of uh, plastic bags from wherever, uh, some rings that you make with paper, okay? Obviously, all you do is get paper, fold it up, and tape it, or uh, make sure that it's nice and tight however you uh, can. Some bottles. If you don't have water bottles, you could use canned goods or some cups. And we're going to use these humongous cups. Of course, if you don't have these, you could use regular cups. And last but not least, make sure you get your water because you might need it to get hydrated, okay? All right, y'all ready to warm up? So we'll give you some time to go get those items. In the meantime, we're gonna be warming up. Y'all ready? You sure you ready? Okay, all right, let's start running in place. Ready? Go. DJ. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Now at home, we usually try to move around. We don't like staying in one spot. So if y'all ladies would like to run around and go somewhere, make sure that you do not hit anybody. If you're doing this at home, please be careful. Don't run over your uh, cat or dog or hamster or your brother and sister. And definitely don't uh, break anything. We don't want to make any parents mad. Okay, we're good for about another 30 seconds. Make sure that, whoa, one was tripped there. <laughs> Make sure you don't do that at home. Uh, Make sure that we get our blood pumping, our cardio on. Again, don't run over anybody. I almost ran over the ladies there. All right, about five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, back to your spots. We're gonna do some jumping jacks. And if you cannot do jumping jacks, I want you to modify here. Okay, and that'll be your modification. All right, y'all ready? Shelly, all right, here we go, go. We're going about 30 seconds. Out, in, here we go. Nice and easy. Great job, everybody. About 15 more seconds. There you go, good job, ladies. All right, so again, if you need to modify, ain't no big deal. We're here to have fun and do whatever you can, but we want you to move and do something, okay? Here we go. All right, we're gonna do jump rope now. So if you don't have a jump rope at home, that's fine, you can do imaginary jump rope. Y'all ready? Just jump in and play. And if you can't jump again, just stop. Bend those knees up and up, up and down. All right, here we go. Just straight up, and you can start going side to side. Put a little different in it, okay? Forward and back. Make sure you get moving. Okay, we can go to one foot, left leg, if you can. Or you could do this right here, and then right leg. All right. Good job, everybody. All right, we're gonna go ahead and do uh, some stretches now. All right, we're gonna go with hamstring stretch. So we're gonna have our feet together and reach for your toes. All right, ladies. If you want to be on the floor while doing these stretches, you may do so. I can show you a few ways that you can modify. Uh, any of you two ladies want to be on the floor, on the ground? All right, right there. So, legs together, reaching for a toe. Nice and easy, right there. We're gonna go about five more seconds. Make sure you get a good stretch. In order for these stretches to be effective, we want you to go at least about 20 to 30 seconds. All right, we're gonna go ahead and go to quad stretch. So right there, Shelly, Coach Shelly. All right, you're gonna go ahead and put that one back here. If you, if you cannot, then you can go ahead and do that. 
Yep. And then make sure that goes in. And then we're just gonna go ahead and here. All right, there you go. Nice and easy, okay? If you, if you have trouble with balance, you can grab something, get a chair, little brother, sister, little uncle, I don't know. Whatever you need to stay on top. All right. Just about five more seconds. Five, four, three, two. All right, we're gonna go ahead and switch. Other side. Grab that foot. You can grab with two hands. There you go. All right, and again, we're stretching those quads. All right, here we go. Good job. About 10 more seconds. Make sure you're breathing, people. Ah, breathe. In and out. All right. Let's go ahead and do some calf stretches. All right. So what you're going to do, since you're on the ground already, you can stay on the ground and flip over to the other to your stomach, and you're going to go left heel to the ground and the right heel up and then you're gonna alternate okay uh, melinda coach melinda all right if you don't know us by now i'm coach palma this is coach uh, melinda or fogelson and coach Tibito or shelly all right you're going to be here all right and try to bring that heel down as close to the ground as possible switch Go ahead and switch. Okay, there you go. All right, you wanna stretch out all parts of your body because if you're running and you're doing all these types of movement, you wanna make sure that your body is ready for those types of moves. Switch. If you haven't switched, go ahead and switch. We're gonna go about another five seconds. Switch. Okay, for these last five seconds, we're gonna go ahead and go both at the same time, and you're gonna have to stay like that. There you go, yeah. So, right here, both at the same time. Shelly, there you go. All right, so she's putting down, bring those heels down all the way to the ground. There you go, all right, good job. All right, we're gonna go ahead and go to arm circles now. So everybody can be either standing up or you can do this while sitting on the ground, all right? Here we go, arm circles. Nice and tight little circles going forward. There you go, getting those shoulders warmed up. We're gonna be throwing, we're gonna be tossing, so we need those shoulders warm. There we go, big circles now going forward. So we want those shoulders to feel the burn a little bit. Let me know if y'all feeling the burn yet. All right, good. All right, now we're gonna go backwards, small circles again. Now this is what I'm talking about, a little small circles. There you go. Good job. Now you see that I'm sweating a little bit. Now big circles, that's what we want. Get a little sweat in. I don't know if some of y'all have it, kind of sweat a little bit during the summer already, but this is a great way to get a little workout. All right, good job, everybody. Y'all felt that good? All right, we're gonna move on. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna do shoulder stretch, right arm across, and all you gotta do is hook and bring in. All right, there you go, keep going. Good job. You go about another 20 seconds. Hold it while you're doing these stretches again. Make sure you breathe in, relax, all right? Our uh, warm-up part where we wanted our uh, heart rate to go up as fast, so we want to kind of equalize it now. We're still warming up, but not as intense. All right, switch. So left arm across and hook and bring in. You want to stretch all this right here, your shoulder. Okay, we just did those awesome arm circles. So we want to get loose now. Good job. About 10 more seconds. Woo, I hope everybody's excited. If you're on vacation, 
Uh, but this is a great time to kind of do a little something before you head out. All right, play a little game, get excited about it. All right, now we're gonna go try some stretch, right arm back, and bring in with the other, pull in. There you go, good job. Thank you, Kelly. All right, just like that, you wanna pull, pull the opposite way. All right, about 10 more seconds. Good job, everybody. Good job, coach. All righty. Again, make sure you go ahead and switch, ladies. Make sure that you're getting your water bottles, okay? Make sure you have your plastic bags, your rings. Uh, here we go. Some bottles, some cups, or whatever it is that you need so you can play the ring toss, all right? Okay, ladies, let's go ahead and do cobra pose this time everybody's gonna go on the ground so you're going to be straight on the ground okay like a plank but your hips are going to be on the floor and then you're going to simply rise up so the cobra pose and you what this is targeting is your lower abdomen all right so a lot of times again we like to sit or we play video games all right we need to make sure that we get working on those lower abs. All right, about 10 more seconds, ladies. And I'm gonna go ahead and set up for the next one. All right, five, four, three, two, one. All right, everybody sitting up. We're gonna have our feet in front of us. We're gonna do figure four. We're gonna stretch out our hips. So what we're gonna do is we're going to put our right leg, our right ankle on top of our knee, not on our knee, because if we put it on our knee or under the knee, it's not gonna be as effective, okay? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring in that left foot towards your body and you're gonna stretch out that hip, that right hip. Now for some of you, you might feel this really well. Some of you might not. So what you can do is bring your torso towards that leg and you should feel it a, a little more. Woo, I feel it. Yeah. All right. Now if you're getting really advanced, what you can do is put your right arm in between the figure four and bring the other hand, the other hand, the left hand and hook it and go on back. All right, but we're not gonna do that today. All right, switch ladies. So back in the face position, we're gonna go ahead and put that left leg on top of that right knee, on top, not right on it, over it. All right, and bring that right ankle or that right foot towards your body. And again, if you wanna feel a little more, bring your hands in closer and your torso in. There you go, right there. Woo, y'all feeling it? Good, good, good. All right, we're gonna go about 10 more seconds. And then we're gonna go to butterfly. Stretch out that inner part of your thighs, and groin. All right, and let's go ahead and go to butterflies. All right. So you wanna put your feet together here, bring them towards you. All right, and with your, if you can, with your uh, elbows, you can go ahead and press down so you can feel a little more. So if you're up here, you want to bring them down and push down so you can get a better stretch. Now, if you're all the way down to the ground, that's good. All right, we're going to have to do a few modifications for you. All right. Great job, everybody. Hope you're all ready for these games. About five more seconds. And then we're gonna go ahead, the last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna add some neck roll so we can uh, get that neck loose. Might have some tension up in the shoulder. All right, you're all ready? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring to the left, head to the left, and then bring down and around to the right side. Okay, stop there. And then bring it back to the left side. All right, 
Now to the right. Other side. Oh, this feels good. Again, some of us might have some tension there. Okay. With all this going on, we want to get a little bit of peace and relaxation. A lot of times we hold a lot here and we're so tense like this, so we don't want that. Other side. All right, if y'all are switching, good job, thank you. Okay, other side, one more. To the left, and one more for good luck to the right side. All right, oh, hope that felt good. Y'all felt good? Yes, relax, not as hard. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and stand up. We're gonna get a quick water break. So go ahead and get some water. So we're gonna be right back so we can play our games. So we're gonna sit up. All right. Welcome back. Hope you all enjoyed that little water break. All right, I hope you all went to get your plastic bags because we're gonna use it. This game is called Parachute Partner Toss. So what you're going to do is you're going to try and both at the same time, if you have somebody to play with, all right, both of you are gonna toss the bags up in the air. And what you're going to do is you're gonna try to get each other's bags before it hits the ground, all right? Now, the, the hint of this is for you to be able to go farther out, all right, to where eventually you're running from a pretty uh, long distance to try to get, get those uh, bags from hitting the ground, all right? So what we're gonna do first, we're gonna try this since we this is our first time doing this. We're going, and then we're, we're also gonna test out and see how these uh, bags fly, all right, before we start running. And make sure when you're running to get the bags, please do not run into each other. We don't want anybody, you know, getting four heads smashed together and stuff like that. So, or tripping on something, all right? So make sure that you clear your space, all right? You don't need a whole lot of space, but you need some space to do this activity. So uh, what I want y'all to do, be right here, about, I'd say like, what is that? Uh, one, two, three, about three, three feet away, three yards away, something like that. Okay, eventually we're gonna get our six feet apart. All right, so what we're gonna do is just gonna toss it, all right, and then we're gonna trade places and try to catch. All right, y'all ready? Go. There you go, <laughs> good job. Okay, pretty easy, all right. Now, you can get a different strategy. I know Coach Tibito, she had her bags like this. I don't know if this flies a little fly. more. <laughs> okay, so it doesn't fly as much. You it. figure out your <laughs> strategy. <I don't> <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, we're still about three feet, so we're gonna take a step back, since that was pretty easy. All right, and try to keep it front. Again, do not run into each other. All right, we can go ahead and get some music in here, DJ, if you want. All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. toss. There you go. Wow, that was a great toss right there. All right, I didn't think that could fly up there. I was actually testing that and I couldn't get that far. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, do we take a step back already? We're here. 
Okay. All right. Now, so, y'all gonna take a step back, or there you go. All right. So they're a little bit farther back. Let's see how this goes. Y'all ready? In three, two, one, toss. Ooh, they got it. Oh my God. All right. There, these these coaches are pretty good. So let's go ahead and do another step. There you go. All right. Here we go. In three, two, one, toss. Whoa, that was that was not such a great toss, but it it was. All right. We were successful. They, yep, you were successful. So good job. All right, now they're gonna go ahead and do one more step back. All right, and then after that we're gonna go ahead and go a long way to see if we can do that. All right, y'all ready? There you go. Yes, should be a little tougher. All right, here we go. You ready? All right. In three, two, one, toss. Oh, they missed it. So, so now what is going to happen is they're going to have to go, and I didn't tell them this, they're going to have to restart from the first spot. So go ahead and restart from the first spot. Don't look at me like that, Coach Thibodeau. All right. So now they have to figure out the strategy. How is it going to fly easier? How is it going to stay on the air longer? All right. This is something that they can communicate. Here we go. Y'all ready? Three, two, one, toss. Ooh, pretty easy. Now take a step back. There you go. <laughs> See, now they're figuring out what they're going to do. They're trying to figure out and communicating. The last time, they really didn't. They thought it was pretty easy until they got to the end, right? Okay. Y'all ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, toss. Ooh, good job. All right, take a step back. Let's see if we can get to that last spot and eventually do that. They were all the way to the red line, so this should be the next one. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one, toss. Oh, <laughs> great job. Good job. All right, they're going to go one more step back. Let's see if they can do this. All right. Here we go. Ready? In three. Two, one, toss. Oh! oh. <laughs> so as you can see, this is this is pretty challenging, and our team members are having lots of fun. You can do this at home. Oh, they want to try this again. They want to try it again. They try to redeem themselves, all right? And as a coach, I'm gonna allow it. Here we go. Y'all ready? In three, two, one, toss. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, she got it. All right. Do y'all want to try one more time? No? Okay, they don't want to try one more time. All right, let's take another quick little water break so we can set up the ring toss. Y'all go ahead and get your water break. Welcome back. We're going to go ahead and start our ring toss, our ring toss, okay? So what we set up right here is some water bottles right here. We put some, one of the big cups, all right? Obviously, again, if you don't have this huge cup, uh, you can get like a little trash can or something like that just to make it a little bit more fun, all right? Or just get a can of good or, or uh, let's say, or a gallon of milk or maybe, you know, something, make sure that it's empty. You can fill it up with water or a water gallon, okay? So it can be somewhat a bit more interesting. All right, so what they're going to do, they're about, uh, let's say, one, two, three, four, about four feet away from the actual uh, objects that they're going to throw into. 
eventually we're gonna move back all right so they're gonna test it out first and see how good they are y'all ready so the first one to finish that's the person that wins all right so you yes once you once you put the ring inside the, or make sure the ring fits over the object then you can go ahead and take it back to you to your base all right y'all ready here we go in three Two, one, and music, please. Go. Ooh, they both got one on that second one. Good job, good job. There you go. All right. Great job, ladies. So remember, if you got that, if you got that first one, all right, you can go ahead and bring it towards you. Uh-oh, we have malfunctions with our ring. So again, if this is happening, that's fine. Just go ahead and pause the game. We're gonna start you off with about a minute. There you go, coach. Ooh, she's trying to go for the big one. I didn't say this, but I did tell them, I did tell the participants, the big one is worth five points. Uh, no, that doesn't count. It has to go completely through the object. There you go, right there. Oh, coach, coach is trying to go for the big one. Here you go, coach. Oh, she broke that one again. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on with these rings. All right. The elementary made them. All right. We're going to get a little more tape here in the break. All right. We're going to buy 10 more seconds. 10 more seconds. Oh, they're all, they're all already on that last one. They're trying to get that last one. Whoa. And again, if you think this is not possible, it is. I tested it out before we started. Ooh. This is kind of like, you know, the games that you do at the carnival right it is so hard to do all right i'm gonna get a little tape here oh! there you go coach maybe this will help you out a little bit more it's the special tape <laughs> whoa about five four three two one time they couldn't get it they all got their regular bottles okay what they're gonna do is now they're gonna go ahead and take about three steps back so they're gonna be about six feet apart all right good job thank you for setting up for me all right this is something that again you can do at home totally not hard this is something that you can have fun with and again we're gonna we're actually going to add some gallons here so y'all can see how that looks like so i believe they they really liked that one it was more it was interesting right all right, so here it is. All right, now we have a little bit more objects. Okay, and again, you can get more objects, more things that you can throw the ring in. All right, here we go. So they're a little bit farther back. We're going to go ahead and play some music and start. Go. We're going to go by one more minute. And then cool off and say sayonara. All right, who do you think is going to win? Coach Tibito or Coach Fogelson? They're both neck and neck. Oh, I see. Coach, Coach Tibito over there trying to scoot, scoot closer. <laughs> there you go. Oh, and now it's a little harder, right? Oh, she got one. We got one. Uh oh, Coach Fogelson, come on now. <laughs> she lost the ring. She's trying to sabotage, sabotage. <laughs> oh, there you go. She got hers. Boom. All right, all right. We got about 30 more seconds, 30 more seconds, everybody. Let's see who gets, oh, Coach Tibito already has two. Come on, Coach Fogelson, don't give up. You can scoot in a little bit, she's scooting in. <laughs> oh yeah, so again, this is a little harder. You might have to put a little bit more weight on your rings. That's totally fine. Oh my God, three. Come on, Coach Fogelson, you have five seconds. Throw your rings, five, four, three, Two, one, and, and that is it. Great job, everybody, great job. All right, and we were moving, and we were having lots of fun. All right, we're gonna pick up really quick. All right, and go ahead and start our cool down. So what we wanna do is make sure you take a deep breath. All right, wait for our wonderful participants. They're so awesome. They resemble our P students. They're so helpful and so nice all the time, right? Okay, we're gonna go ahead and raise our arms up, breathe. 
and let go. Take a deep breath, all the way up, and let it go. One more time. And you can stretch out your hamstrings at home. You could do, you know, butterflies, all that good stuff that we did. Again, so you can uh, have a pretty cool cool down. Pretty cool cool down. That rhymes, right? All right. Now, again, this is Coach Palma. If you don't know us, this is Coach Fogelson and Coach Thibodeau joining us. Make sure you join us again. Quick shout out to Kellen Garcia, Romeo, and Zane. Thank you for watching. Make sure you all keep watching every single week and every day. All right. Remember, stay safe, stay active, and be healthy. Yeah.